we join our intrepid guide, Uncle Finny, at the big deer show, where he's desperately trying to land a sucker, or uh, a customer. <laughs> I'm looking for a good customer here to say, oh, this guy's got some money. What, what, how you doing there, bud? Doing fine. How you and doing? you're interested in some buck hunting? <laughs> Sam, I was just going to try some of this out. Uh, you hunt much? No, this would be my first time. Well, you picked the right guide. Right See? Right. Look at that. See, I'm a guide. All right. I See? got the right guide. <laughs> well, there, Mr. Frost. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Well, I would think, uh, you know, you said you hadn't been hunting much, huh? Nope, this would be my first time. Oh my gosh, where are you from? Uh, Chicago area. Chicago area, really? Mm -hmm. So what do you do for a living? I'm a financial investments broker. He is? Yeah. Really? Mm-hmm. Hey, did you ever see that 30 point buck over there? No, uh, I haven't. Well, uh, if he's still over there. I, I, yeah. I, th I think uh, I think we could do uh, uh, a little business here. Think so. Yeah, you want to get a big buck this year, don't you? That'd be a good idea. Yeah, you're tired of hanging around the deer pens, right? I've never been to a deer pen. <laughs> good. Ah, excuse me. Oh. Oh. Sorry about that, bud. Sorry about that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, let me clean one oh. of them off here. <laughs> Ooh, I got one of my glasses there. Okay, now, if I if I wanted to get you up to a good deer camp, would you come? Depends. How good are the deer? Well, take a look. What do you call them? Now, these are deer now, that's from your nice... <laughs> No, 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 that's the wall of shame, son. Oh. Okay. But I, I do have kind of a kind of I kind of know that one over there from about 20 years ago I think. Uh -huh. <laughs> Anyhow, uh, we could get you up there to uh, Whack a Buck Lodge mm -hmm. and uh, come up about a week early, you know, because okay. <laughs> then the bucks are really in rut up there mm -hmm. and we got clean shots at everybody. Okay. And you know if 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 you're really thinking, you know, you hunt much, right? I've never been hunting. Really? Okay. Really. Well, you come up a week early, you know, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna need a little down payment, you know, for this. Okay. Let's and see. Uh, you'll have your choice of deer stands. You can do whatever you want to do. Well, it looks like no I cash. Left, left no my cash? cash somewhere else. Oh, and you left it somewhere else. Okay. Take a charge card. <laughs> well, sure. Yeah, I take a charge card. I got. Hey, I can bring you right up to the camp right here. Sounds good. Here, pull that out for me, will ya? Yeah. Get that out of my coat. There. Okay. So, uh, you can come up and see us anytime. Mm -hmm. We can run this through. Oh, ouch! All right. This one's for you. Thank you. This one's for me. <laughs> hey, now that you're coming up to the lodge, hey, uh, you got, I'm going to give you one of Uncle Finney's The Big Deer Book mm -hmm. by Uncle Finney. It's a wildlife manual, and you're going to need that to hunt in the deer stand. And, Here's the kind of bucks we're going to be tracking. Holy <laughs> Yeah, you better believe it there, bud. <laughs> you put that in your coat, and you study that. Yeah, I can tell you're going to be a good hunter there, bud. <laughs> All right. Ah, uh, anyway, what do you think? We could probably get one up there like that. So I'll see you one week prior to... Uh... Well, here's your charge card there, oh, bud. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> A little concerned about that for me. So I'll see you. Yeah, one. yeah. I'll, I'll send you the roadmap. Sounds good. Thank you. And you. And, and bring up. Uh, don't forget to bring some beer, okay? Some beer. We're running fresh beer out guy. up there. And uh, we'll show you the cabin fever, the barbed wire, the deer stands, the big bucks. You'll have a blast. blast.
It's a week before opening day at Deer Camp. Gordy's gambled away the food budget. Luckily, he won a two-minute shopping spree in the clearance aisle at Sticker Chinsky's Last Gas Gambling Emporium Bait Shop and Grocery Liquidation Barn. <laughs> and now they're unloading his winnings, but the way Gordy cooks, no one will taste the difference. Hey, how come yeah. the fridge don't work? Didn't you bring the gas? Ah, don't worry about it. This ain't no uh, country club, you know. You don't need no fridge. Ah, yeah, yeah, country club. Ah, <laughs> uh, Gordy, come on. <laughs> Let's not forget one thing. This here is a deer camp. What do you mean, a deer camp? <laughs> yeah, you know where the men are men and so are the women. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about and the, the sheep? sheep run scared, I'll tell you that. Ah. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. What are you going to do? We don't want all this stuff to spoil. It's $300 worth of food here. Well, uh, an old Indian trick here. Uh, you just uh, take that stuff out on the porch, you know. Yeah? <laughs> Where, uh, you know, it's cool on the outside, warm on the inside. Like your girlfriend, you mean? Or? <laughs> yeah. Tip up. Tip up, Lulu. Oh, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. All right. Take it back, back, back out. Okay. Yeah, no, no, no. That's Put all it out on the porch. Put hey, your act together here. All right. <laughs> hey, whoa, whoa. Out here on the porch. Yeah, it's nice <laughs> cold out here, ain't it? Oh, okay, take all it right. all back out again. All right. Yeah. Everything out in the cooler. Remember, cold take it out on the, the outside. Hey, warm hey, on the inside. It's a new guy. Hey, hey right. it's a new hey. guy, Mr. Frost. Well, How you doing there? Mater. Oh, doing all right. Yeah, well, Mater. Uh, find a place all right. Well, I'm here, aren't I? Yeah, well, yeah. Well, you yeah. should have been here three days ago. Well, jeez. <laughs> I got lost, so I had to stop at this tavern and show the map to the owner, and he oh, couldn't really? heads or tails of it. Yeah. As soon as I said your name, he knew exactly where I needed to be. Oh, I know who he is. Well, He's the guy responsible for this. <laughs> All right. So, they bring the beer. Like I oh. promised. Hey, you guys, it's going to be great. Hey, we got the wilderness. Peace and quiet. No women. No job. No phones. Oh, come on. But plenty of work. Get some work, will you? All right. All right. That's a fib for ya. One lousy six pack. That'll last about six minutes. Boy, oh boy. Just... <laughs> boy, oh. we got a lot more here than I thought. You know? Yeah, I kind of a deja vu bag, I think. You can never get this stuff all out of here. How much well, is this? There? much work coming hey. in, huh? Hey. No, oh, what's no. this? What's this? What's this? This is real, real oh. familiar. More hey. Yeah. Yeah. What's uh, I don't know. That's a lot of work. I thought I, I took that one out already. Whew. That's a tough one here. There you go. Hey, Thanks for the beer, but uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Well. keep that cold. Keep that cold. There's uh -oh. another bag for you. Son. Yeah, yeah. Well, here, <laughs> here. Take that oh, one okay. yourself. All right. Yeah. <laughs> what about them coons and skunks? Are they gonna get into this food? Ah, uh, don't worry about them critters. Well, what about the bears? <laughs> hey, hey, no swearing around here. Besides, the bears suck. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Well, that was hard work. It's just about ruski time, I think, don't you? Yeah. Viva. Yeah. We like that stuff, you know. Ah, yeah. Well, this is this it. Is it. This right is it. This is what we came here for. Deal yeah. the cards <laughs> and open the beards and sound again. Yeah. yeah. Ah, yeah. That's right. <laughs> oh, boy. Where is it? Yeah. Hey, well, here it is. got a lot of stuff. Oh, what? Oh. Here we go. All right. <laughs> so, anything else I can do to be of assistance? I think he's done quite enough, don't you? <laughs> yes, he has. What? It's a fib. Three days later, it's still raining. The hunters are stuck in the cabin and have grown restless. Tension's building, and so is the smell. Oh, well, I don't know about Gordy, but you can do it. What are you going to do? <laughs> huh? It's your turn. How is my poker face, Mr. Frost? What do you think, huh? <laughs> I think he's taking you for more than the guiding fees. You know, you, did he ever tell you he didn't have a license? <laughs> well, like I say, take a ride with a guide. <laughs> if you raise me on this one, uh, I'll bet you one pair of dry socks. And I'll even throw in my hemorrhoid ring. <laughs> what do you think here? Why don't you put it back in under you for now? <laughs> if you lose it... Throw it, this is the new pot. <laughs>
<laughs> hey, Gordy, what's for supper anyway? What's for supper? Your favorite. You mean you move no rosen, Connie? Uh, you know, uh, you know what that is, don't you? No. <laughs> it's big shit and raisins. <laughs> he he mm. cooked that last year. Yeah, I know. It smells yeah. worse going in than it does coming out. <laughs> yeah, he's making them sour cookies oh. again. Hey, what do, you say, what do you say we part his hair, huh? Yeah, <laughs> hey, let's get him. Yeah, let's get him. <laughs> part my hair. That's what I get. You know, that's what I get for Shvinya Gubna Rosenkami. You said. What I want to do to him tomorrow, he wakes me up at 4.30 in the morning, don't you think that He's we He's going to go check it out again? Yeah. At 4.30 in the morning. And then he'll wake us up. Yeah. This is it. This is the idea. Five-gallon pail, right? Five-gallon pail full of some kind of water. From the creek? Yeah, or else from... Uh, the, the latrine. The latrine, the outdoor the toilet the there. Okay. And we balance this above the door there, up on okay. that little shelf up there. It's raining so hard, it's uh, it's raining cats and frogs. <laughs> hey there, Frosty, wake up. I got a little hunting buddy for you. <laughs> now, where's that itchy bitch? He's got to be around here somewhere. Hey, <laughs> Finny, it's all done raining now. <laughs> guys I started a fire <laughs> hey Fib it's time for the big deer dance nah it's time for you to dry out yeah well uh, mr. frost only brought me a six-pack you a six-pack I thought we were supposed to share what do you mean I thought that was for us to share uh oh uh oh are you guys ready for some football? What? Oh, that's Monday night. This is Saturday morning. You know what that means? Cartoons? No, it's almost time for the lead to fly. I heard it over there. I thought it was behind us. Yeah. Above. Hello? I'm telling you, me, you hear something and smell something at the same time. Oof, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Hi. Yeah, you guys deliver? Oh, fantastic. Yes, I'd like to order a large Chicago-style Supreme. Hey, you that Frost guy? Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, Frost looks busy. <laughs> All that screwing around is getting kind of contagious, though. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Kind of reminds me, uh, after that dirty douche bucket trick this morning, I think I could use a bath. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, that feels good. <laughs> Woof, <-da. laughs> Oh, my ass is warm here. <laughs> Getting real hot. Oh, holy jiggers is that hot. I gotta cool this off. Hey, Squeaky, how's the water, huh? <laughs> Having fun? <laughs> oh, I think I'm getting in too. <laughs> oh, squeaky, I'm sorry. Here. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder what Frosty's up to right now. Hmm. <laughs> Holy Christmas, Frost! Don't you have any common decency? Hey, I'm not seeing any deer. Well, well you're a fib. What'd you expect? What? I, I mean, um, me and Squeaky were taking a bath. <laughs> what? Oh, hi, Mom. Uh, can I call you later? Thanks. Bye. I'm paying you to find deer, not sit around and finding bubbles and beer. Well, well, well don't crap. worry. Start worrying until Thanksgiving, okay? Oh, that's it, Finny. You're in some serious hot water. I think it's time no, no, to take no. a ride. No. <laughs> Let's go, buddy. I got a place for you. <laughs> oh, you're mine. You're mine. <laughs> well, Frost, I think it's time maybe you and I took a little break today, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, uh, did you read that big deer book I give you yet? Uh, no, not yet. Well, that'd be a good idea. If you want to start seeing deer, uh -huh. you read that book up there. Oh, really? Yeah, start with chapter one. And what's that about? Yeah, it's about getting to know the local yokels. Uh, okay. <laughs> and I got just a guy. Yeah. His name's Sam Putz. I, I, I mean Yutz. Why? Yeah, Yutz. He's got a camp about three miles down the road, uh -huh. and uh, you can go down and see him, and he might have a couple hot tips for you. Well, better. <laughs> well, he lives here all year round. He knows everything. Let's go. Oh, pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Seen anything? I seen one back that way. Yeah. Yeah. Now I thought you were gonna go northwest. Yeah, I am northwest. Don't you know nothing? What do you mean? You're northwest. a fib. That's it. Uh oh. Barbed wire. Yeah. Now, let me tell you how to get through this. Okay. Now what? Now, here. Um, you pull it up for me and I'll try to make it through, okay? Okay. Alright. I gotta get through here like this. Okay. Nope. Oh. Go on. Oh. <laughs> okay. That looked painful. Ow. You do this often? Here. I'll get through again. You watch. Uh, I'll make it this time. Okay. Nope. Oh, shit. You're not getting too far, are you? Here. Let me show you how to do this. Wait, Try it. you're going to climb over this? Well, yeah. Have you done this before? Uh, plenty of times. 
God, that looks painful. What if Plenty you slip and what if you slip and fall? I'm I'm a pro at this okay. stuff. Okay. Hey. I was born on the trapeze. All right. Yep. Whatever you say. Okay. You know. All you, oh 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 ah 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 ah. What I tell ow, you? Ow! What I tell ow! You? Come on. Ow! Oh! God, that was oh! Ow! How was that? Good. Here, let me take your guns. All right. That's not exactly the way you do it. But okay. Okay. Now you come across. Come on. Come on. Okay. Nice move. Wrong gun. I need another piece yeah, yet, you right sure here. Yeah, you do. I, I'll right give there. you one more piece. Watch I'll out, set. though, because that chili from last oh, night. Oh, don't tell me about your chili. <laughs> Get up there. I think I got some bad gas. Hold still. Don't oh, move. Oh, yeah, just whatever you do. Yeah, I think I'm going to cut you. the I cheese, though. <laughs> Hold right here. still. I need it right here. Don't move. What are you doing? Yeah, I'm just going to tape you, you up. Don't worry. I'm going to hey, fix what? this. Hey, what? I'm fixing you right up. Hey, yeah. This is perfect. Yeah, this is beautiful. Yeah, don't go anywhere. Stay put. Yeah, don't move. Don't want you getting lost. Yeah, hang on. Almost done. Yeah, we're getting there. Oh, almost there. Right, right. How about? Oh, yeah, right about there. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, you're all fixed up. Well, must say, it's been a pleasure working with you. Get back. Enjoy your show. Cut me loose. I'm going back. Cut me loose. Cut me loose. Hey. Oh. oh! Have a nice time! Hey! Hey! Get back here! Come on! Get back! <laughs> ah. Hey, Ross! <laughs> How's it going? How is that deer lesson with Yutz? Well, that Yutz, man, he really is a putz. Yeah, what do you mean? Well, he tried to get the point across, but, you know, I think it was him who got the point. <laughs> you don't say. Mr. Frost, buddy, uh -huh. can I call you? Can I call you Steve? Sure. Steve, you know you, you know what you need. What do I Some need? Some goddamn bucklor. What's bucklor? What's bucklor? Oh, yeah. it's like a deer attractant. It's does like a it, magnet. Does it work? Oh, does it work? Hey, Frost, you're just in time. I'm having a big sale, and there's only two bottles left. You can't go wrong. This bucklor works so good, they'll come with their tongues hanging out. Yeah. <laughs> hey, that red Gordy. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right, Finny. Hey, Frosty, this is the stuff right here. Big sale. You know, this is the good stuff. Whoa! The security system was still armed. Excuse me, we gotta use a rat trap to keep the deer away from this stuff. This is it. Uncle Finney's magic buckler. You can't beat it. And uh, for only a buck 280, they're both urine. I mean, they're both yours. Uh, you got the light and the dark. You got the suspended solids. And then you got this one's collected from some female four-legged animal at the heat of her bicycle. You can't go wrong. <laughs> and if you get a little tired, you just take a jolt yourself. What do you think? Yeah. Fresh, huh? How much? Well, a buck two eighty for both. A buck two eighty. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, that's close enough, Ross. Oh. That's close enough. I tell you what, I'm gonna <laughs> throw in the squirt machine for you, huh? Yeah, yeah. This stuff's you know, good put stuff. Put some of that on. Yeah. How about a free application? Come on over here. Cover sense what you need, Frost. You gotta think like a deer and stink like a deer. Woo. Yes, sirree, Bob. <laughs> right, Gordy? That's the good stuff. Yeah. There we go. So why am I in this wheelbarrow? Well, Frost, we don't want to waste none of this stuff here. What do we got? Like recycle. Recycle. Uh, recycle. Yeah. It's important, okay. you know. <laughs> oh, God. This stinks. Yeah. No, it's well, good for you. At least you oh, don't smell God. like a fib. <laughs> hey, I've, I've been meaning to ask you about that. What's with this fib stuff on the back tag? Oh, uh, well, that stands for uh, fat, ignorant, and bald there, Frost. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. You're not You're not fat, ignorant, and bald. I mean, it really means you're one of them uh, fearless Illinois barbarians. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, now, Great. you know, hey, look, he's got a built-in scent oh, boy right yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Hey, now, this is the light stuff. This is the cover scent. Yeah. So you don't smell like a pizza no more. This is the good stuff. Pizza? Hold still, yeah, yeah, hold, yeah. Still, hold still, hold still, hold still. There. Now this. Okay. Now this, now here, the, this is the dark stuff. And the dark stuff, you take a, you take oh. something like an old pair of underwear like this, yeah. see? And then you pour that, that dark stuff all over that. And then you drag uh. this behind you and it really makes yeah, you come around. Ah. Ah. Oh, 
Oh, no, you don't. Ah! You ah! Ah! Frosty! Oh, God. <laughs> Man, I'd want to get that behind me. Yeah. Why well, you take the rope? No, no, that, this is it, Frosty. You yeah. take the rope. Listen up. You take that behind up. you. Yeah. This will work. Yeah. This will work. It will. This works. Yeah. The deer will come. It really yes. does? Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm on it. I'm going. All right. Yes. He's going to score. Hold still. Hold still. Hey! Hey, look at you! <laughs> Get out of here. Have you seen anything yet? Shh, go away. Man, I ain't seen nothing out here. How's it going? Would you, would you shut up? <laughs> hey! What do you think you're doing? Yeah, this morning I seen a spiker, and then later on I seen like a forker, and then after the forker, you never guess it. Right along, hey, what the, what the? Ah! What are you doing? What? Ah! <laughs> mm, not bad. Want some chips? I'm off this way. I'll chase him right to you. Hey, look at you, <laughs> having fun. Where have you been? You <laughs> left me here all day. Yeah, it took me a long time to get from here to there, but we finally made it. I want to talk to you. It's a darn good thing I don't have my phone. I'd be on that thing with my lawyer talking about false advertising, poor mismanagement, bad planning. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, what hurts? Uh, yeah, how's the gun? Uh, you okay? Uh, yeah, it looks pretty uh, good. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, get Where your butt I? up here, son. What? Oh, <laughs> geez, it's you. I told you I'd make you a hunter. Oh, God, my <laughs> head. You! I haven't seen Diddly Squat. What is what this? You, you sell me it's this book, big... you bring me up to this camp, there's Ooh. no deer I haven't seen squat. And what the hell is that? This here's a muzzle poon. What do you do with that? A muzzle poon? Yeah, see that? Jeez, hey, poon. watch where you point that thing. <laughs> Yeah, she's got the uh, the uh, uh, the grunter on the back, uh, <coughs> and then you got this here musky. I mean, uh, buck reel on the front, and then you get him with this here muzzle poon. Yeah, notice the high tensile steel of this ductwork that I got out of the cabin. See that? After many years of research and development, I have developed this all on my own. <laughs> Just to keep you in the deer stand, I guess. I don't know. Well, that's a goofy <laughs> looking crap. Out to the swamp. We're gonna go for swamp bucks. Uh huh. So, uh. The bucks in the swamp? Yes, sir, re Bob, and they're uh-huh. hard to get. We're gonna get you one of them great northern swamp bucks. Uh huh. Here, try this, try this puppy out there. Then don't forget to set the drag, okay? Okay. <laughs> so, All right. What's something like this cost? Uh, well, uh, I, I suppose I could sell it to you for about, uh, uh, probably at 25 bucks, you know? Fine. Let's go. I don't have all day. <laughs> I am an entrepreneur, I'll tell you that.
Two, three minutes and a gas grill. You know, it's a built-in rotisserie function at Gordy, only only offered it by Gordy's. Hey, Gordy's grilling out. You're gonna love it. Some guys like them smoked like this, you know. That's always a nice touch. You know, smoked food is really health, <coughs> really healthy for you. <coughs> and a lot of guys really <coughs> like it smoked. You yeah, see what I'm saying? That apple, that birch. That sobbed birch, uh, that, that, that maple, <coughs> hickory. <coughs> Some guys really like this smoked meat. I tell you, myself, I don't like it that much, but they say it's it's really healthy for you. I gotta get out of that smoke us for a second. Now, this is really some healthy stuff. Apple, hickory, birch, whatever you got, salmon, birch, uh, you know, swamp wood, uh, hickory, uh, basswood, whatever you got. Uh, you know, uh, alder in Oregon out there, they really like that alder smoke stuff. I prefer uh, no lead. No lead, that's the best. No lead. <sighs> now, you, you, you notice, you grab that sausage. You see what happens? Comes right off on your hand. Now, that's all that smoke there, you see? That's all that. That's all that smoke and that. Mm, tastes pretty dang good, I'll tell you. Mm, tastes pretty damn good, but um, I like them smoked a little bit more than that. But, you know, when you get your hand like that, that shows you something, don't it? That shows you that you're really getting some damn good smoked meat there. That's the good stuff there, guys. Smoke them up. Smoke them if you got them. That's what they always used to say in the army. <laughs> smoke them if you got them. Well, the, the fire went out, but as you can see, smoke them if you got them. That's what I say. Now, there's one that's really smoked good. That is taste, a taste treat. You know, and if you, you want to keep the shadows off your face, you can always use this stuff. When you're going in a deer blind, you know, that'll keep the shadows off, and then you'll see more bucks that way. Works great. Multiple use uh, sausage there. You can eat it. You can rub it on your face. You can eat it for shoe polish if you want. Damn good stuff. Smoked meat, it's a wonderful thing. Smoked meat's a wonderful thing. That's what I say. Okay, well, come on back again for some. Hey, supper! Come on, come and get it, you guys. Supper. Supper's on. <laughs> I'm going to gobble this crap right up. Supper's on, guys! <laughs> <laughs> oh, McDonald had a fire. E I E I O. Hey, Hildy, are you there? 
Hildy, over! Hey, Hildy, are you there? Are you there? Over! This is Hildy, over! <laughs> hey, this is me, is that you? Oh, this is me, who's this? <laughs> Here's Finny there, how you doing? Oh, Finny, how you doing there, honey? <laughs> hey, I need a little favor from you. What's your name, sweetie? What? <laughs> I got big problems. Yeah, critters went and ate all the food off the porch. Yeah. Down to my last cup of noodles, then Gordy, he went and burned up the last of the Goldern Deer Dogs again. Smell that. It's disgusting. <laughs> so, uh, can you get up here and help me out? Oh, Benny, for you, you got anything for you, honey. Hey, <laughs> Gordy's up here. Oh, that Gordy, oh, I like him. <laughs> All right, Hildy, I'll see you when you get here, okay? Okay, Benny. What you gonna make? Okay, I guess so. We'll see you then. Okay, Ten four. <laughs> hey, Blue, I like you. It's a fresh red cow. My luck is good today, honey. <laughs> Whoop, boy! Whoa, wait till Finny and Gordy see this one! Whoop, whoop! Mmm! Whoa, it's fresh! It's big! Whoop, whoop, whoop! Whoop, whoop! Hey, you don't want to contaminate the meat! Always wear your gloves, eh? Ha, ha, ha! I love being a camp cook! Ha, ha, ha! Woo, woo! Fresh meat! That's my number! Ha, ha, ha! Ha, ha, ha! Ha, ha, ha! Ha, ha, ha! I gotta look for a red cow! Swamps is a real good place for a road kid. You keep your eyes peeled, honey, eh? <laughs> Ooh, what's that? Yeah, there's a road kill up there, honey. There's a road kill up there. That's what I like. Ooh, boy. Ooh, now there's a, this is a situation where you need the little helper. That's a really stinky one. It's either a three-day-old dead deer, or maybe it's a German shepherd. I'm not sure which. Look, we slip it on, and you're all set. The handle. Clear your mask, make sure your mask is clear. And then, you're ready for the raunchiest roadkill. You don't have to age it, you don't have to hang it. You can just pluck it and suck it. <laughs> real good stuff. Oh, your gloves, don't forget your gloves. That's right, and then you're all set for even those really bad ones. I can tell that's a bad one out there. That's one of the really rotten ones. So you make sure you're all set. <laughs> oh boy, that one was really greasy and drippy, but I'm all set, I'm safe. A lot of bugs in there, you know. But I'm cleaning up the highways, keeping America safe and well fed. <laughs> Tell you what, I hey, ain't, hey, I, hey, I hey. ain't had so much. Who's that? Who's that? I was gonna say I ain't had so much fun, but <laughs> that's Hilda. Yeah. Gordy, <laughs> that's Hilda. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's what I come to camp to get away from. You had a thing last year, didn't you? Oh no, no. <laughs> I don't want to have Gordy. nothing going on. I hey, Hilda, come on over, over here. That road kill, that road come kill. Come over here. Gordy's over here. My intestines <laughs> can't take that. Oh, I gotta go. That road kill cooking. <laughs> Oh, Hilda, over know. here! Sorry, come on! She oh, that brings some good night. stuff for you! <laughs> <laughs> that brings some good stuff for you, boy! Oh. Yeah, yeah, you little rascal! It's good to see you! It's deer camp God, I'm starving, Hildy! What do you got? Got all kinds of stuff. I'm starving. Yeah, we got a couple of critters here. Ooh, all right. Yeah, we got some roadkill. <laughs> Start out with good, healthy food. You know, you got some celery. You got some potatoes. You got this discolored cabbage. It looks like this. It's colored like this. It's discolored. That's good stuff. Then you got some of those canned sauerkraut. You got some more celery. Yeah, you're gonna yeah, parboil that. that sucker, huh? What else is in there? Oh, you got another boob. Oh, you got your secret ingredient. Oh, you take a little flour and you put a little flour on this stuff like this, eh? Uh-huh. That's it. Okay. Then 
you, you, you take your, you know, you got a nice clean plate like this. You chop this stuff up, see? <laughs> chop it all up. That makes a good gravy, see? Chunk it up like that. Good gravy. That's good stuff. A nice discolored cabbage that's colored like this. Hey, put a little beer on there. Get out of there, you oh, okay. <laughs> You watch it. Oh, what are you doing there? I just covered that, you little sucker. Just, oh, dang, kids. <laughs> Hiya, honey. I just come down to get some water from the lake, you know. Oh, I better not go right there. <laughs> I better move over a little bit here. A little bit of good water. You don't want that stuff in there. A little water for my stew that I'm making for you guys. How you doing, honey? Back to the camp. Then when you got that going nice and good, you get that ready, you come over here, and you use your little 30-point buck rack, and you take your, uh, yeah, nice. take that off the fire very carefully. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> and you add those beautiful vegetables in there. <laughs> oh, don't worry about that. That's clean. That's good and clean. You get that in there, and you stir that up a little bit. That's looking good. You get that back on there. Then you get her back on the fire again. That'll be just right. You let that cook for about seven or eight oh, hours. Well, whenever it's done. <laughs> and you get to the main course. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Here's a nice little fella. Oh, it's a buck. It's a buck squirrel. Hey, he'll taste good in the pot. Woo, baby. Crushed skull. He'll be good. Mm. Then you got your main course. Then you got your main course. Woo! Woo! Oh, this one's still kicking a little bit. Yeah, I'll take it for you, He's still kicking. Yeah. Woo, 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 woo. I guess you got him. He ain't kicking no more. Okay. The animal rights people love that shit. <laughs> okay. This is a road kill. I found him on the highway. Good big coon. He ought to taste real good. Then you got your chainsaw. You got to think about safety. So you always got a good tool. And you got your goggles. Keeps you nice and safe, you know. <laughs> Put your chainsaw on. I picked up. You know, if you keep your eyes open, there's all kinds of good healthy stuff out there. Take a look now. We're gonna go down here and we're gonna skin this windshield rabbit out for you. Well, when they've been laying a while, they never skin real good. I like to start with the hands. Then you can get them going here pretty good. But once you get it going, it just kind of comes off pretty easy, see? It's just like Skin a rabbit, like your old grandma used to say. <laughs> skin a rabbit, skin a rabbit. You know, just take the coat off. Take the coat off. You know, get him right down there. Get him right down to nothing like that. There's a lot of meat down there. That's good meat down there. Get him right down there. Get the front legs out. The front legs are always tasty. Then you got your back legs. And you're rid of that tail. And then you're all set for the pot. Just off with the head real quick. Break the front legs. Try not to get them too dirty. And they're just about set for the pot. Yeah, that's a, a taste treat that anybody would be proud to have. Good roadkill. <laughs> Where's that fire now? Where's that pot? Get him in there. Then when you get them all scun out like this, you know, you get them all scun out, I just keep the carcass right on there, and then you bring it over and you get it right in the pot. You get it, you scoop them up, you get them right in there, and then you just let them simmer like that for a while. 
Get him in there real good. Let him get him just on the fire. You let him simmer. Long as it takes. Then the bones just come right out, eh? <laughs> Some of the best gumming you'll ever have. Hey, guys. Ready for more? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna tell your mother there. Well, you know, uh, yeah, if you're gonna hunt tomorrow, you better you better clean that up. That's good stuff there. That'll keep you going. You'll be able to get that deer. Just think of a hey, come back here. Good stuff. I hope you don't see me. <laughs> oh. You forgot your grub there. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this is your broke part. Come back here. Woo! <laughs> hey, young whipper snapper. Yeah, I remember Gordy told me about you. <laughs> Was it true? <laughs> well, Gordy, that, that guy, I tell you, I've been chasing him all over. And I just can't quite seem to get a hold of him. That Gordy's a little <laughs> shy, you know. Yeah, I see. I'll show you his deer stand later. <laughs> oh, good. I'd like... He's right up in there. I'd like to go leave a, a little landmine there for him. <laughs> woo, woo. Oh, look at that. I left it. I'm so careless in my old age here. I just got How gotta, much we owe you there, Oh, you owe me just a couple of hugs there, Vinny. <laughs> Hey, how you doing out there in Buck Hunt land? This portion of our programming is brought to you by Constipados. The little brown pills with the one-two punch here. You better have a couple, buddy. Oh, you look like you had one already. That's C-O-N-S-T-I-P-A-T-O apostrophe. Oh, there you go. Yes. <laughs> The little brown pills with the one-two punch or the one-and-a-half punch, whichever way you're looking at it, they'll knock you loose and get you moving at deer camp. Mm. And they got that chocolatey taste that kids love, too. Don't let them eat the whole box or you'll be at the practicologist. I, I gotta go myself! Last one in's gonna stink like a rotten egg! That's <laughs> oh, C-O-N-S-T. Yes. <laughs> I think it's time for a good hunt, don't yeah, you? I think I'm about due for one. Yeah, I'm going to do a little guiding today. I think uh, we'll get you all set up it's here. It's about time. <laughs> yeah, when November comes, that's all that Finny thinks about is deer. Tell you what, these guys couldn't track their way across the Galdang playground. He's even going so far as uh, he's planting things out in the woods. Look at this now. He's making that poor client of his think that he's really smelling and eating deer doodle, -doo, deer raisins. Ha! Huh. When in reality, they're chocolate. And he's grossing that kid out, trying to impress him. I tell you, that Finny, he's a weasel, but he's a sly fox. From time immemorial, guides have supposed to been your friend, supposed to help you out. Even if you pay through the noise. Not this Galdang guy, he's my no good brother in law. Vinny and I'll tell you the truth right now. Look at him. He's leading them around and around in circles in the same acre or two of gal darn Christmas trees down there by the swamp. And the Feb, he don't even know which way he's up. And he's gonna charge him for it. There ain't too many guides that'll lead you wrong. A guide's supposed to know the lay of the land. Well, this is, you know, like knowing your own backyard. You know why Vinny knows it so good? Cause it is his own backyard. Well now look at a kid. He can't even figure out where he put his gun. He probably stopped to take a leak, set the gun down, walked away without it. Now he's panicked. What the heck's he gonna do? Oh, he's on his back, right on his tush. Once again, the fearless Fib can't even keep his powder dry. But with a guide like Finny, I ain't surprised. A real guide, now mind you, a real guide, not my no brother good-in-law here, Finny, would be scratching his head if he was confused. 
You see where Finny scratches when he's confused. I don't know what that tells you, but every once in a while, even a fox does something stupid. Well, he's finally lost his client, but look at the kid, he's found his own deer crossing. He can read the signs. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that kid ain't so dumb. Yeah, them guides. A lot of them got really good eyesight. You know, they can just see uh, like an eagle. And uh, they know the lay of the land. They can read the sign, you know? Yeah, he can read the sign, all right. He's lucky he can read his name. Look at that, he can't even tell that he's on private land. He needs some quadfocals or something. I think them glasses are about 300 years old. Tracks, tracks are important when you're hunting. Look at him, tracks. That's the dirty pointer, guys. I mean, when you think about a 12,000 pound deer, you gotta study on the book. And Finney wrote the book on tracks. I'll tell you what, this guy, he passes himself off as a pretty good guide. Look at that, he'll show you there's the turny pointer, there's where he dropped these candy wrappers, there's where the turny pointer was eating chocolate duds, there's where the turny pointer was drinking beer, you know? And a guy like the Fib, he eats and drinks all this crap up that Finny gives him. In reality, there he is, my no good brother-in-law, lolling around, had a few too many beers, it's a good thing he ain't carrying a gun cause he wouldn't pass a breathalyzer test. Takes a smart guy to think about tracks that big though. Now that's what happened to them pickle tails that I wanted. Yeah, it takes a real guide to pull something this stupid. And my brother-in-law went to the Galdang Guide University at the intersection of County Highway P and U. He needs a good swift drive and a butt. Even when the wind's blowing 45 and it's 30 below, and the old flag is all ripped up, you know, that fib comes back next year, we could probably buy a new flag <laughs> and a snowblower. <laughs> you know that Finny, he lives well. Even though the fib's been lost for four or five hours now, he's a smart guy. He's not out there scaring the deer out of the woods and screwing up your core area. He come back to camp and he's catching some rays. He knows how to live right. Nothing like a cold beer on a hot day for Finny. Now, like I said, the wind's blowing 45 and it's 30 below, but Finny, you gotta remember, back in 73, he froze a couple of lobes of his brain together, and uh, now he's got nerves of ice. So, you know, to him, this is uh, kind of tropical. Now, even though the fib's been lost, Finny trained him right, and he knows he'll make it back, he'll sit down, he'll figure it out, then he'll follow his tracks. <laughs> You know, even a fib will come swimming home through the snow. If you give him enough galding rope, he'll hang himself, too. Ah, there he is! Hello, Fibby, come on in. <laughs> you know, good thing Finny charges by the hour. That way we make more money while the fib is lost. <laughs> come on, fib, drag your butt in here. You know that fib, I think he's all right. I think he can come back to camp. He made the grade. All he needs is maybe a drink of cold beer and a hot sausage and uh, yeah, maybe some sterno to melt the frost out of his beard. <laughs> frost on frost. Gotta like that. Frost, over here. Shh. Right there. Ooh. Yeah. Boys, come and pick them up, oh, yeah? huh? Yeah, oh, we'll great. take care of the whole thing for oh, you. Thanks, Finny. <laughs> oh, that was fantastic. Hey, Mom. Yeah. How you doing? Yeah, I just got back. Yeah. Got a buck. Well, I don't know. No, they're taking care of it. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to get rid of this 10 year old yeah. freezer burn meat right now. Oh, <laughs> Frost will never know. Fantastic looking. Yeah, the guys All right. Are doing the hey, Frost. Now. Gotta go buy it. <laughs> hey, my boys are quick. Hey, Finny. Look what I got. Oh, this Here's is mine? Yeah, this is mine? Yeah. Oh, hey. cool. I got your meat all ready to go. Here. You got, it's done? Yeah, yeah. Here's your steaks. Here's oh, your steaks. Wow. We got a couple of tons of deer dogs here for you, too. All right. How you like deer that? <laughs> 1987? Oh, no, What's no. Fry, uh, Gordy, he's kind of dyslexic. <laughs> it's, uh, uh, 
19.87 pounds. Oh, there you go. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is great. All this from that buck? Yeah, there you go. Oh, now you're all great. set. Oh, this is fantastic. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. Aren't you glad you came? I'm so happy. Hello? Oh, hi, Jack. How you doing? <laughs> oh, you're kidding me. Serious? Okay, thanks. Yeah, bye. Hey, so what's up there, Frost? <laughs> well, my assets are frozen. Well, uh, why don't you have a seat on the stove? No, Finny. That was my accountant. <laughs> he said I don't have the money to pay you. No money? That's what I said. I don't no have money. the money. Hey, I ain't taking no IOUs. I need something better than that there, Frost. Something I can get my hands on to hold for you there. <laughs> okay. Tell you what. My car out there, it's paid for. Oh, yeah. Here's the keys. Hang on to the car. I'll get the money wired to you. I'm going to make a phone call. I had my eye on that little red race car there. Don't be doing anything <laughs> crazy now. Oh, it's okay. I'm just going to go see a friend. I'll be right back. Uh... Ah, the fresh air. The wilderness. The little cabin nestled in the woods. That's Bushwhackabuck. That's what we call home in our deer season. You come home to camaraderie. You talk about the deer you missed. <laughs> then you got guys like Yutz the Putz. Yeah, they peeled him off a rock down there in the swamp. He was just frozen stiff with deer lure or something. Hey, he was pretty funny, though. away. <laughs> we might be nuts. Look at me! Oh, oh, oh. I was skiing after that deer, of course. Being a super Polak, I love to ski. Well, that's the end for now. We look for deer. We love to hunt deer. We're looking everywhere, but I think the deer are looking at us. Hunt safe, that's the main thing. Don't do the stuff that we do. You might get hurt. <laughs> and we want you around so you can buy some more of that banana stuff. Finny will be selling you some in a little while if I know him. <laughs> Take a ride with the guide. Uh, uh, to order the album, the Dirty Point Buck, call today. <laughs> America's number one deer season classic. 1-800-USA-1944. <laughs> yeah. Dirty Point Buck. I'm a deer hunter, how do you do? I got the deer hunting rapping tail for you. I'm so excited, it's my favorite time of year. I love to feed my buns, chasing trophy deer. But don't clap your hands to the stomping of the feet, cause yeah, he's like me. He can't, he can't keep a steady beat, no. Come on, I guess we can ride with a guy. That's what I always say. Good the hunting is my life. It's my chance to drink beer and get away from the wife. It's the boys night out, acting stupidly, saying out payment. I'll take care of it. <laughs> <laughs> well, he partied all night, never made it to our bunks, and I was sitting in the tree stand on a tree day drunk. Wind was blowing 45, temp 30 below. I was freezing to death, then it started to snow. So I got down from the tree stand, start heading for the truck, and that's when I seen it there. The dirty point buck. Thirty point buck. Thirty point, thirty point buck. Thirty point buck. Well, he was eight foot tall, weighed twelve thousand pounds. With every step, there was a sh sh shaking on the ground. He was so wonderful, so beautiful. Strutted right out of my dreams. He was created by God. Just for outdoor magazines. <laughs> now I'm not much for thinking. No, I don't do it often. But I had an idea. Yeah. Well, yeah. What? what? What do you mean you gotta go? I thought you went before we left. All right, I guess we'll go back. Gosh, this is embarrassing. I think I'm gonna end this sucker myself there, Rufus, and you can take a ride with Clyde. What do you think of them apples? 
Y'all, my only hope was Betty Lou. She was Ooh, the one. Oh, quiet. I'm hunting reindeer. <laughs> it's the only time of year when uh, deer come to our house, right? <laughs> Ooh, uh, Merry Christmas, by the way. Huh? <laughs>